part of speech in English. The same concept in every language. So this helps you recognize it everywhere. Let's give it a go. Welcome to Parts of Speech in English Worksheet, level grade four upwards. Don't skip this. Too many learners have no or a poor understanding of the parts of speech. Fact is, if you know it in one language, you know it in every other language too. They only have another word for them, e.g. noun, nomen, substantive, sustantivo, are all the same part of speech, noun. So, make a good effort here and the road ahead will have fewer obstacles. Please complete the exercise on each page and mark them with the memorandum at the end. A word is put into a category, group or class according to the job or function it has in a sentence. Nine main parts are briefly explained here. So find the job a word has in the sentence, then you found its part of speech. Now we have nine sections here, but only eight official parts of speech. One, nouns, two, adjectives, three, pronouns, four, verbs, five, adverbs, six, prepositions, seven, conjunctions, eight, interjections. And then we just add on determiners at the end. Some learners never get to know the parts of speech. Why not? It takes time. The time is now. The following pages give the basics about each part of speech. More detailed coverage will be done in separate videos. Please read and speak along as much as you can. You can always pause the video and or replay it. Take in what you can and come back to review as many times as you need to return. Make time to do the review at the end. Please do the exercise parts in writing. 1. Nouns are naming words for things, objects, a person, an idea or a quality. Match the word and the correct object or person. Airplane, aircraft, we have pilot, wing, tail, cockpit and exhaust. Now we have people here, a tennis player, a golf player. We have a fireman and a scientist. Now you can match multiple words for the same character or same person here. Two, adjectives describe or modify nouns, e.g. woman is described by pretty, pretty woman. So pretty is my adjective. Add a descriptive word for each person or object below. We use commas between adjectives when writing more than one for the same noun, e.g. I have a chubby, cute little puppy or let's reread it i have a chubby comma cute comma little no comma puppy the last word before the between the last adjective and the noun there's no comma there so we have adjectives to choose from here fast blue old young great experienced lonely tired fit small clever female bright famous and male we have a picture here of an airplane with gaps. You can decide what words you want to put there. If a word is not in the list here and you still want to put it, feel free to do that. On the right hand side here, we have the fireman, the scientist, the tennis player and the golf player. Three, pronouns substitute replacement for a noun. The word pronoun means for the noun. So, I can put the pronoun in the place of a noun, e.g. the man, he, a hat, it. The subject pronouns below are in red and the object pronouns below are in blue. So, I can have pronouns in the subject and I can have pronouns as objects. So, let's look at the picture. Everyone in the photo, including me, is we. If I want to say... They sat with us, that's the pronoun in the object place. Everyone except me, they sat there, we saw them. The man, he, I met the him. That's the object for the word he. The table, it, and the table, it, for both subject and for object. 
The lady, she sat there, we saw her. The author, I wrote this, it was written by me. 4. Verbs are action or being words, e.g. talk and run our actions, became occurrence, or is, was, being. NB, important notice, please repeat examples after me. Try match the following verbs with an object or person in the picture. E.g. digs will be the excavator. The excavator digs. The bird sits on the float. Take these 12 verbs here. Think, run, sail, carries, race, writes, compete, looks, sits, stands, won and succeeded. Match them with the pictures. You can have multiple adjectives for one setting. 5. Adverbs describe verbs. There are many kinds of adverbs, e.g. adverbs of time, manner and place. Try match some of the verbs with an adverb from the box, e.g. quietly. The bird sits quietly on the float. The excavator digs fast or forward. Verbs are given in red and adverbs in green. We can make adverbs from adjectives. Adjective plus ly equals adverb. E.g. sweet plus lee is sweetly. And there are three more examples here in the column below. Attentive plus ly is attentively adverb. Beautiful plus ly is beautifully adverb. And perfect plus ly is perfectly adverb. 6. Prepositions show the relationship between a noun and another word, e.g. the cat sits on the table, so it's cat and table in relationship here. Use from, at, beside, around or during where they best fit. Now just remember, if you want to use at two times, it means you should replace it one time with another word. 1. The chef works the bakery. 6.2. We are sailing Durban. 6.3. Mummy has returned the shops. 6.4. The screwdriver lies the spanner. 6.5. The policeman works the night. 7. Conjunctions link or join words or groups of words, e.g. man and woman, tea or coffee. Fill in the missing words. We have because, but, or. Kitty, the sun is up. Kitty, wake up because the sun is up. The pot is big, the food is not enough. The pot is big, but the food is not enough. Do you sell hot dogs? Do you sell hamburgers? Do you sell hot dogs or hamburgers? Number eight. Interjections express strong feelings, emotions, e.g. Yippee! Ouch! Wow! Mmm, that was good! Yeah, yeah! King cat, that me! Oh no, my last flower! Brrr, I'm freezing! Make four sentences using any of the interjections on this page or any other of your own choice. Let's review one. Please pause the video when you have the first sentence before you, copy it, fill in the part of speech for each word, forward the video to get the teacher's answers and make your corrections where needed. This is our sentence, we copy it down. The clever student works eagerly through an assignment. First, find the verb, works. Then we go for the nouns. The things in the sentence, the objects. We have student and we have assignment. Then is there a word that tells me more about student? Yes, clever, adjective. Is there a word that tells me more about noun, assignment? Yes, her. Now, we, the rest of the words we just fill in what's missing. We have a determiner here, the, a specific student. We have the adverb here which tells me more about the action eagerly describes how the student works then lastly we fill in our preposition through 
which is the relationship between what the student is doing and their assignment. Ah, that's great if you finished it all. Let's review two. Please pause the video when you have the first sentence before you, copy it, fill in the part of speech for each word, forward the video to get the teacher's answers and make your corrections where needed. There's our sample sentence coming up. Wow, I always wondered why she was late. The interjection stands out so I can first identify that. Now look at the sentence further. I always wondered why she was late. I have a conjunction in the middle here, which tells me I have two things that were combined. I have I always wondered and I have she was late. So I've got two simple sentences here and what I look at now is a complex sentence. Start with the verbs first. Wondered. There is another verb because there's another sentence. Was. Is there something that tells me more about wondered? Yes, always. Therefore, it's an adverb. My subject is I. Who was late? She. Subject, she. Pronoun. So I have two pronouns here. I have I and I have she. Late is an adjective. It describes the more about the person, she. And then I have conjunction in the center there. Determiners or articles are not regarded as a separate part of speech. They mostly take the role of an adjective as it modifies the noun. There are only three. A. Unspecific before a consonant. And unspecific before a vowel. The specific person or thing. Any specific person or thing. That means either if it starts with a consonant or a vowel, you use the all the time. E.g. A or any dog and or any apple. There's my exercise 8.1. Any man, honest man can be any great friend. Fill in what's missing there. 8.2. I had any apple and any strawberry with specific dessert after lunch. The secretary sits on a chair at the table. Memorandum 1 nouns. Match the noun to the correct object or person. Matching them, I've got the tennis player there, I've got a fireman, I've got the golf player, and the scientist. Now, more than one line or word for each of these persons. Tennis player woman will match with the lady also. Man will match three individuals, the golf player, the fireman and the scientist. The fireman and the scientist. Sportsman is the golf player. Golf player matches golf player. Fireman matches fireman, and then scientist will match scientist. Memorandum to adjectives, e.g. pretty woman. Pretty tells him more about women, therefore pretty is an adjective, because woman is a noun. Add the descriptive word for each person or object below. Fast, blue, old, young, great. You've got the airplane there fast or old airplane, great and young tennis player, clever, experienced pilot, bright blue sky, small cockpit. If you just wrote one word for each of these, it is a good start anyway. Experienced golf player, lonely fireman, talented female tennis player, clever old scientist, handsome man, pretty young woman, famous sportsman, stylish little lady. If you've got differences there or other adjectives you use there, it should be fine. Memorandum 3. Pronouns for review purposes only. The subject pronouns below are in red and the object pronouns below are in blue. Everyone in the photo, including me, we or us. 
everyone except me, they or them. Notice again, they for subject pronoun and them for object pronoun. The man, he is subject. The man, him is object. The lady, she or her, the author, I or me, the table, it or it. Memorandum for verbs allow for some changes. Try match the following verbs with an object or person in a picture. E.g. digs, the excavator digs. The truck carries. The bird sits on the float. I've got the extra verbs here. Thinks, run, sails, carries, race, writes, compete, looks, sits, stands, one, succeeded. You will decide where to match them or which picture to match them with. Memorandum 5. Adverbs describe verbs. Verbs are given in red and adverbs in green. We can make adverbs from adjectives. Adjective plus ly equals adverb. E.g. sweet plus ly is sweetly. Fast, attentive, forward, beautifully, upright and perfectly are all adverbs. Let's decide where to match them. The truck moves forward. The excavator digs deep. The bird sits quietly. The girl is running fast. The man stands still. The man writes fast. The girl jumps high. Memorandum 6. Prepositions. The cat sits on the table. Use from, at, beside, around or during. Where the best fit. 6.1. The chef works at the bakery. We're sailing around or to Durban. Two was not given, but it may be used there. 6.3. Mummy has returned from the shops. 6.4. The screwdriver lies behind or beside the spanner. You can also use behind there. The policeman works during the night. Conjunctions. Memorandum number seven, conjunctions e.g. man and woman, tea or coffee, fill in the missing words, because kitty wake up, the sun is up, kitty wake up because the sun is up, the pot is big, the food is not enough, the pot is big but the food is not enough, do you sell hot dogs, do you sell hamburgers, do you sell Hot dogs or hamburgers. Memorandum number eight. Interjections. Own work. Emotions. E.g. Yippee. Ouch. Wow. Make four sentences using any of the interjections on this page or any other of your own choice. Mmm. That was so good. Oh no. My last flower. Yeah. Yeah. King cat. That's me. Brr, I'm freezing. Memorandum 9 for determiners. There are only three articles. A. Unspecific before a consonant and unspecific before a vowel. The specific person or thing, e.g. A or any dog and or any apple. Exercise 8.1. An honest man can be a great friend. The secretary sits on a chair at the table. 8.2 I had an apple, a strawberry, with the dessert after lunch. Thank you so much for participating. Pictures, own and online. Everything else, you could see it. Please click like and subscribe, click the playlist link for other videos or the PowerPoint presentation thereof in the description box below. Bye for now, see you soon again.